Hi students, in this video we are going to see to calculate the density of a crystal, how we can calculate the density and how we can relate it to the edge of a crystal and problems related to. So keep watching. Calculation of density of crystal, edge length of crystals are usually expressed in picometers. Picometer is 10 to the power minus 12 meters or in centimeter it is 10 to the power minus 10 centimeters. Now density of the unit cell is equal to mass upon volume or mass of unit cell upon volume of unit cell. Now as we know mass of unit cell is equal to how do we calculate the mass of unit cell number of atoms in the unit cell into mass of each atom that will give you mass of the unit cell Z is number of atoms M is mass of each atom. So Z is uh, now how do we get uh, this values mass of unit cell is equal to therefore Z into a, capital M upon Na what is capital M capital M is the molecular mass molecular mass upon number of atoms that is Avogadro's number. So if you take uh, one mole of any substance it has Avogadro's number of atoms or molecules in it. So Z into M upon Na this this whole thing this will give you M small m that is mass of each atom. So we are finding mass of one atom here. So number of atoms into mass of one atom. Now that is mass of unit cell. Now what is the volume of the unit cell? The volume of the unit cell because it is cubic it has got each side is A so V is equal to A cube. So we will substitute that here A cube. Therefore density of cell is equal to Z into M upon Na that is Avogadro's number divided by volume of the cubic cell A cube. That is equal to simplified form we can write Z into capital M divided by A cube into Na. So this is a formula that we can use for calculation of density of a crystal. Now let's solve a problem on this. The problem CuCl cuprous chloride has an FCC structure face centered cubic crystal. Its density is 3.4 gram per cm cube. What is the length of the edge of the cell? Now for FCC number of molecules per unit cell is 4 we know that and Z is equal to 4 therefore. Next we have the molecular mass of CuCl atomic weight of Cu is at 63.5 plus 35.5 divided by 99. So sorry uh, when you add it you get 99 and uh, the sum is 99 that means molecular mass of CuCl M is equal to 99. Now density is equal to Z into M upon A cube into 10 to the power minus 30. Here this 10 to the power minus 30 is coming. This is because A is in picometers. When you take A in picometers it is 10 to the power minus 10 meters. Now when you cube it the 10 to the power minus 10 becomes 10 to the power minus 30. So A cube is equal to so A cube into 10 to the power minus 30 you have to put there so that the value becomes in picometers. Now into 6.023 into 10 to the power 23. This is the value of Avogadro's number Na. Now you can change the formula bring A cube to this side. So you get A cube is equal to 4 into 99 divided by 3.4 comes this side into 10 to the power minus 30 into 6.023 into 10 to the power 23. Now calculating this 4 into 99 into 10 to the power 7. So divided by 3.4 into 6.023. How did this 10 to the power 7 came? This 10 to the power minus 30. When it goes up it becomes 10 to the power 30. 10 to the power 23 goes up it becomes 10 to the power minus 23. So the difference when they are multiplied the difference in powers will become 10 to the power 7. So you have these value now. Now you can substitute it in the calculator. So you get a value. When you calculate it, you get 193376.37. So this is the value you get for the A cube if you calculate. Now you take the uh, cube root of this. Cube root of this value when taken, you have cube root is 578.21 picometers. This. So this is by taking cube root. So all this can be done in the calculator. So you have the edge length of the cube. What is the edge length of the cell? So that is 578.2 picometers by calculation. Now another question. In this question the edge length of NaCl crystal is given as 564 pm and has FCC arrangement. So FCC means we know Z is equal to 4 and A is given as 564 
picometers. Now what is the molecular mass of sodium chloride? Na is 23 and Cl is 35.5. So adding NaCl is 58.5. So you have 58.5. Now density uh, is equal to Z into M upon A cube into 10 to the power minus 30 into Na Avogadro's number. That is equal to Z is 4 into M is 58.5 we calculated divided by 564 the whole cube that is a cube into 10 to the power minus 30 into Avogadro's number 6.023 into 10 to the power 23. Now you can put all these values in the calculator. So where you will get the values that is 4 into 58.5 divided by you can open a bracket 564 into 564 into 564 that is cube into 6.023. So you can close the bracket and you will get the answer that is uh, the answer that is coming is 2.16553 into now the 10 to the power 7 because this 30 goes up and 23 also goes up so it becomes 10 to the power 7. So this is what you get as the density of the cube. Okay. So this is equal to into 10 to the power minus 7 and also this one also is coming as 10 to the power 7. So this is a calculated value and this is a 10 to the power 7. So that is equal to 2.165 we can write as gram per centimeter cube. So you know this 10 to the power minus 7 this is from the calculation and this one is coming from the difference of these powers these times when this goes up 10 to the power 30 and this goes up as 10 to the power minus 23 so the multiplication gives 10 to the power 7 now this one is coming from the calculation when it is calculated through calculator it is coming so both of them will be cancelled now so you get 2.165 gram per centimeter cube so this is how you can calculate density and from density you can calculate the edge of the cell so I think students you understood this one now you can go through this video once again if you want to understand it better and uh, you can subscribe this channel so that you will know the next videos that are coming and uh, that's it. Thank you.